Scott Neal, and I'm an instructor at McKendry University in Lebanon. You, you put people into a situation and let them work things out, and that, and then you come back and you talk to them about what you saw happen with games or activities and things along that line. And from that, people can assess and go, oh, I, okay, I see how that works. Until you see it from a, a different perspective, you look at it and go, oh, we're not successful because those people aren't doing their job. And really it's communication and teamwork. And so being college graduates, they're very likely to be put in a situation where they're a boss and they're a manager and they've got to create a team in their environment. And I wanted them to be able to see that there's tools out there that they can use to create team and how much better things work when you do have a team cooperative communication situation. This year I thought if I've got the right group I might I might step out because there were things that I wanted to do that I just, in years past, I just didn't have the confidence to do. And it was outside of the box of what a normal health class would be. And one of the homework questions was, who was someone that had a uh, uh, impact. impact on you that perhaps you didn't thank enough? So I asked them to write that down. Well, the day that they turned that in, um, I said to him, I didn't know how this was going to work, I said, you know, uh, while I'm setting up the presentation, um, you guys can get your phones out and you can text whoever that person was and express thanks. And I didn't know what to expect, I thought, this could go flop, you know, they won't do anything. Um, but I said, I'd, I'd like to know what you find out. Well, I got this great, this great feedback, they, they contacted people. There was numerous ones that got back in touch with me and said, "This was the impact that I had with that." Or, you know, this is the you know, it, it was so great to, to tell that person this, uh, that how what they, how they had, how they had affected me. And so then I uh, thought, "Oh, this is great!" It gave me some encouragement to keep going. I am Desiree Vance. I am a freshman at McKinsey University. Putting a smile on somebody else's face made my day because knowing that I could make somebody else smile, just even by giving them something encouraging, it, it made me happy. Like being knowing that I could just I could do that just by a simple quote, showing that I can. The more I gave, the more I received, um, and I that was kind of the idea behind it giving project, I told them, the more you give, the more you receive. And whatever I gave, it seemed like I got back more in return. In fact, there were times where I felt like I was learning more than, than I was teaching. So, I feel like the biggest thing with the Even Project is what we gave, we gave to someone else. And I, I want them to carry that on. I want them to continue to keep giving. I want them to want to make somebody else's day. I want them to take a step back and think, what can I do to give somebody else something? Um, I felt like that was huge too. I, I don't know, I just, the giving, it, it could really turn someone's day around. It can really make someone take a step back and look at things from a different perspective. Um, yeah. Can I explain, like, he's not a professor that just gives you your stuff that you need to know. He wants you to learn it. So like, before every single test, we would have a study group and he would stay after and would stay away from his family to come and help us study. So we knew what we were going into. Um, if we were taking a test, and me, like multiple times, I was freaking out because I just couldn't remember an answer. He would ask me, what do you not understand? I want, I want you to learn. I want you to know. I don't want you to just guess. And he would teach me even. We all work together, we all 
wanted to learn something and I've taken now three health classes and this is by far the most I've learned in any of my health classes. Research out there that says, you know, doing good things for people relieves your stress, helps somebody else out. And so that was kind of where it, where it started in my head. If there was a word or a phrase that described that kind of atmosphere you had in your class, what, what would that be? Believe.